we prepare for dangerous cold just days away, today is a solemn anniversary. It has been four years since the icy crash that took the lives of three first responders in Lubbock. KCBD News Channel 11, Sydney Louther joins us in the studio to share how the community and Lubbock Fire Rescue continue to honor their memory. Sydney. Karen and Abner, on this day in 2020, a pickup truck hit a patch of ice on I-27, veered across the interstate and into another crash where police and fire were already responding. Lubbock Police Officer Nicholas Reyna and Lubbock Fire Lieutenant Eric Hill were both struck and killed. Firefighter Matt Dawson was critically injured. Additional stations. Today marks four years from the tragic incident that took the lives of Lieutenant Eric Hill Firefighter Matt Dawson and Officer Nicholas Reyna. At the request of Chief Ferguson, LFR will recognize the moment of silence. Really, it's, it's a somber day for us, uh, just to remember them, the contributions they made to our department, to the police department, and uh, just what great people they were. Lubbock Fire Rescue Chief Sean Fogerson says since the accident, January 11th has always been dedicated to remembering Fire Lieutenant Eric Hill and Officer Nicholas Reyna, with Firefighter Matt Dawson by their side. But after the loss of Dawson in November, he says this is the first anniversary they are grieving all three of them. Everybody in the community wanted to see him and wanted to talk to him and, and tell him what he meant to them. It brings it home even more that, that he was lost so unexpectedly. Chief Fogerson says the tragedy that happened on the side of I-27 will never be forgotten, especially by our first responders on scene. And those thoughts do creep in about what happened four years ago and, and actually what the potential that could happen right now is. But to honor the life, legacy, and sacrifice these three men made, the department has made efforts to prevent this from happening ever again. Closing the roadway that we are on, we now close adjacent roadways if it's appropriate. In the past, we used fire helmets, so now we use a more compact helmet that doesn't have a brim that is not as likely to be knocked off. And LFR continues to educate the public on how to keep our first responders safe. Slow down, take your time, and make sure that all of us get to go home at the end of our shift. Lubbock Fire Rescue honors Lieutenant Hill, Officer Reyna, and Firefighter Matt Dawson by keeping their memory alive. And we, we talk about Matt and Eric and, and make sure that, that everybody remembers. We're, we're never going to let that die. The 555 Safety Organization, funded by Lieutenant Hill's parents, is asking everyone to leave their porch lights on through Friday morning to honor their memory. Karen and Abner. Thank